Namaskar. Hello and welcome to P Guru's channel. I'm your host, Sri Ayer. Monday mornings are Delhi, our Rajagopalan time. Last week we missed it, but he's back again today. And we're going to talk about a lot of interesting things, scoops galore. And also, please like this video. If you have not subscribed to our channel, do subscribe to our channel. And here is Delhi, our Rajagopalan. Rajagopalan ji, Namaskaram and welcome to P Guru's channel. Namaskar, Namaskar, sir. So kind of you. Namaskar, sir. Namaskaram. Sir, this is Navaratri week. Uh, to all our viewers, a happy Navaratri celebrations. So I have my colleague Jayanti Chandramauli who has done a very beautiful Durga Shloka and we are going to listen to that now. And thought I thought I'll give you one week break, sir, from doing Shlokas and we'll be back again doing Shlokas very soon. So here we go. Namaskaram. This is Jayanti. Today I'd like to share a shloka for Durga Devi from Devi Mahatmyam. Sarvasvarupe sarveshe sarva shakti samanvite bhai bhyastrahi no devi durke devi namostute sarvasvarupe sarveshe sarva shakti samanvite bhai bhyastrahi no devi Durke Devi Namostute. O Devi, who exists in all forms of all that is divine, you are the possessor of all powers. O Devi, please protect me from all fears. I bow to you, O Durga Devi. I hope you enjoyed that. Rajagopalanji. A little birdie came and told me that Paltumar, Nitish Kumar, is again doing Palti back to BJP. What is going on, sir? Uh, namaskaram to Shri Ayyav, uh, P Guru viewers, and also Madam Jayanti has you know, rendered uh, uh, you know, Sloka very, very effectively, and it is uh, very soothing to the ears on Navaratri days. So I have a competitor now in the form of Jayanti. <laughs> 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 and, and you know, uh, in my early days, of course, I started to have that uh, Veena recital. Along with that, you know, the uh, Samavedam I was wanting to learn. Somehow, now she has done that. Now, come to the point, sir. Paltumar, Nitish Kumar. Aglebar, Nitish Kumar. He is coming to NDA fold, but BJP is not taking him inside, sir. So Lalu Yadav left him in Lach. Nitish Kumar is in Ardhanadishwara, neither nor this side, that, not that side, like that. Nitish Kumar is going to... He's in Trishanku Sargam. Trishanku Sargam. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And Nitish Kumar has spoiled his own reputation by going against Modi, by going against Nitish Kumar, uh, Lalu Yadav. And he has taken 360 degrees now. And his ambition of becoming Prime Minister is doomed. Push again, delay it. And now Lalu Yadav wanting to ensure that Nitish Kumar is out of Chief Ministership before 2024 elections. That is why yesterday in a function that is on 21st of October, Saturday, there was a function in uh, uh, Patna. He mentioned that I have never been against the BJP. BJP leaders, BJP ko ideology mera band par hoga. like that, you know, it is in my heart. All the theories and, you know, programs, policies, ideologies of BJP are dearer to me, his heart. So, therefore, there is a change of heart. The largest story, sir, from this is India Alliance, I.N.D.A, India Alliance is going rest in peace. It's dead now. R-I-P, rest in peace. So extinction of Nitish Kumar is the dream of Rahul Gandhi floating anti-Modi campaign that Gamandia, Gamandia, uh, what Mr. Modi and BJP spokespersons are describing India alliance is Gamandia alliance that is gone for six years. Sir. Push for yes. So why did why did Lalu Yadav not want Nitish Kumar to become the convener, sir? I mean, see, convener is just a naam ke vaste, name thing. If you don't have enough uh, MPs behind you, you are nobody, right? So why did Lalu Prasad object to Nitish Kumar? 
to answer your question, why did Karunanidhi object Mupunar becoming prime minister in early 90s? Same logic. I don't yeah. want another person from my state to be the head of the country, head, head of the st state. So therefore, no, no uh, question of Lalu Yadav agreeing to Nitish Kumar. That is personal rivalry there. Wow. So each, wow. each one is cutting each uh, feet like that. The one is pulling the rug. Another is playing politics. Therefore, Bihar politics has come to 360 degrees circle, sir, full circle. Nitish Kumar Palturam, the kapra badalta hai bar bar. This bar, he cannot do that, you know, because Modi. And the, the, since we are in Navaratri and we heard Jayanti Chandramauli song also very well, we are do puja, I do perform Navaratri puja, Mahisha Suramadhani. Tomorrow is auspicious day. One thing I tell you, sir. You can't antagonize Mr. Narendra Bhut. He is a Devi Upasaka. And he gets Devi Amba in his body. And he is not even taking water for the seven days. And he observes this breath very sincerely. Therefore, the Ugra Sakti of Lord Narasimhan, Ugra Sakti of Mahishasura Mardini combined together or in the form of Narendra Modi. Whomsoever is antagonizing or crossing the path of Narendra Modi, they are having a doomsday finished, like Chandra Babu Naidu, like Adapati Pranisami, like Uddhav Thakre, like you know Sanjay Raut, Aam Admi Party. You can't cross his path because he is not only he is sincere, he is a sincere you know devotee of Amba, Amba Devi in Gujarat, the Mahisha Suramardini in West Bengal other parts of the country, Navaratri Puja and therefore during Navaratri I say if Nitish Kumar tries to come back to NDA fold, Narendra Modi will do Mahishar Surar on Nitish Kumar. Politically? Politically. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Now, Akhilesh Yadav, he has a oh, problem with my. the Indian National Congress about he wanted six seats in MP elections. Looks like MP elections. Kamal Nath said, look, the Indy Alliance is only for national elections, not for state elections. Sir, these people are on Chaku ki Noch, on the edge of a knife. The majority between INC and BJP in uh, Madhya Pradesh is so tight. Why is Kamal Nath trying to buy a new enemy, sir? Uh, uh, this is scoop number two, which I am going to tell you just now, Mr. Iyer. You diplomatically put it, whatever uh, the words of exchange, words of war of words between it, uh, Akhilesh Yadav and Mr. Kamal Nath. But the worst part is, if you go to the Twitter handle of IP Singh, the spokesperson of uh, uh, Samajwadi Party, he says that Rahul Gandhi pagal ho gaya. He mentioned that Rahul Gandhi has gone mad. Can you imagine a Samajwadi party is ignoring Rahul Gandhi in Uttar Pradesh? And uh, Mr. Akhilesh Yadav's representatives were made to wait for two hours at uh, Mr. Uh, Kamal Nath's place. Digui they see, they all spoken to each other, but still six seats they are not giving. And in six seats they are very confident of winning at least three or four Samajwadi party on their own. Now, Chirkut. Chirkut is an unprintable terminology in Hindi, Bojburi Hindi. And Mr. Rahul Gandhi, according to Mr. Akhilesh Yadav, Rahul Gandhi is a Chirkut. Such type of you know, abuses have been heard against each other. Do you know what Kamal Nath mentioned to uh, uh, Akhilesh Yadav? Akhilesh, Pikilesh, Kikilesh. <laughs> So if, if you have such type of differences of opinion and you know anger on each other, but Rahul Gandhi says Mogapat ki dukan, nafrat ki dukan, what is it? Nafrat kiska hai nafrat? This enmity and you know vituperativeness. Nafrat means uh, enmity. So Rahul Gandhi should learn from Mr. Kamal Nath and Mr. Akhilesh Yadav that at least for time being, there should not be any exchange of words in public that will derail the India Alliance. Second, uh, rest in peace for India Alliance. 
Sir, uh, one, one, one quick uh, development. See, you saw this uh, new big deal that happened in Tamil Nadu, sir. In front of Annamalai's house, they were going to flag a fan, plant a flag. They had they had got the thumb done, but they had not even started flying the BJP flag. DMK comes and gets it uprooted. And right opposite this, there is an even bigger flag of DMK flying. You know why they uprooted this? They uprooted this because a member of the minority community expressed fear that this might fall on the ECR road, East Coast Road, and can uh, cause damage. See, what, <laughs> the, uh, what BJP said is, okay, we will take down ours if you take down yours. And you know what they did, sir? They went and arrested Amar Prasad Reddy, who was the one leading the charge uh, or who was the spokesperson for BJP at this particular venue. They have arrested him. And another volunteer has been um, severely beaten up. My question to you, sir, is DMK has gotten itself into a big problem. And I am going to ask you to tell me how they are going to come out of it. And I'll tell you what the problem is. Annamale got so upset with this. He said, from November 1st, inside Tamil Nadu, every day, BJP will plant 100 flags, all 40 feet, 50 feet tall. And already Karur, I've seen the video. They've got 15 ready, 1-5. They're ready already. This is just one place, one place where they are working. They've got 15 ready. That guy says, Mane, I'm going to have it, but tomorrow everything. So people are so upset. Now, here is the question for you, sir, how they are going to solve it. November 1st, 100 flags. Second, 100 flags. Third, 100 flags. Fourth, 100 flags. So, at this point, if DMK does not stop BJP, then pretty soon, everybody will be talking about this. And the elections for the five state assemblies on are on 8th November. And if even if DMK and ADMK is a chup, moon ek honne ka, Annamale will still make political capital out of this. Look, these are the Sanatana Dharma destructors, destroyers. I have shown you that I will make plant this thing. And these guys are so afraid that they don't even want to touch my flags. So first having felt the first flag, are they going to take down 100 flags every day? If they do that, then <laughs> India Alliance will scream at DMK. If they don't do that, then they look like fools. So how is DMK going to come out of this, sir? It's a tricky situation, catch-22 situation for DMK. They caught into that the, in the trap of Mr. Anamalai. DMK is unable to retrieve itself from this catastrophe. And, and I would like to mention to P. Guru viewers that DMK is in a boiling pot. Very soon it will explode. Internally, DMK is not that good, sir. Externally, they may give a pretense, but internally, things are very, very bad. I know I speak with authority because few members of parliament, few close leaders who are close to the chief minister are all in a cagey situation because there are three raids. And from Tuesday onward, there may be one or two more raids starting. Tamil Nadu is in the grip of crisis and Annamalai is adding fuel to the fire. Anna Malay has emerged as the single largest enemy of DMK. And there is a rapprochement between DMK and ADMK. This morning, Mr. Udenidi said ADMK, DMK will fight together to abolish, you know, to bringing up of uh, anti neat resolution and the need will be abolished. So, therefore, Sangali, Pangali, Virudali, like that, you know, you are my relative, we are all good, like that, you know, this type of. Goody goody words are not going to help. That is why Anamali is striking at uh, uh, you know base of uh, the DMK. You ask me a question: How the DMK is going to retrieve? It's a cash twenty two situation for Mr. Stalin and BJP. That's gross in Tamil Nadu. It's going to be a uh, nightmare for DMK because me, having been a police officer, Anamali knows where to strike and when to strike. And Tamil Nadu. Real uh, opposition leaders or two IPS officers for Stalin, 
the ADMK gone for its, you know, stature. Erapati Pairnisamy, now he is another, another grip of uh, crisis. Madam Chayalalitha, as long as she was alive, and 2014-2019 election manifestos of the ADMK, Jayalalitha spent. She herself told me in uh, 1950, uh, 2015, that Ram Mandir is in the election manifesto of B, uh, the ADMK. The only one party which supported Ram Mandir when the crisis was still on is ADMK. How oh, Mr. Yadapati Pairnisamy is going to balance this? So therefore, Yadapati Pairnisamy will miserably fail according to my calculations. The reason being, Yadapati has gone too far to appease minority votes. So therefore, he cannot retrieve for Ram Mandir. In the 2026 20, uh, or 2024 Lok Sabha polls, will ADMK support Ram Mandir? So that one crisis flag, Ram Mandir, these contradictions, you know, flag, uh, Anamalai is wanting to hoist it, put DMK in a tight spot, put Andrade Anamalai, put uh, Yadapati Pandisami in a tight spot because uh, ADMK is deviating from its original path of Jayalalitha that she is the architect of Ram Mandir, she, she is no more. The Ram and the trust they have invited Yadapati Pandisami. Is he going to attend or not? We need to send some representatives. These are all certain questions. Therefore, double edged weapon in Tamil Nadu, the only uh, strong opposition, at least in the you know social media, media, public level, there is a groundswell for BJP. I am very confident if elections are held, Anna Malai will prove. 18 to 20 percent of votes for BJP, surpassing ADMK splinter groups. And the flag is only a Mokota, a Nishana to DMK. Sir, uh, one other important information that I don't know how many of you know, viewers, this came on Friday. The Supreme Court has stayed all Archaka appointments in the temples of Tamil Nadu. And Dr. Swami is the one who was one of the petitioners, and he has warned the TNHR and CE any new appointments, you let me know, and I will go to contempt of court. So the TNHR and CE cannot do any mischief anymore in these temples. And 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 uh, Dr. Swami has taken the right course, and followed up by Dr. Swami's clarion call. And Mr. Narendra Modi also spoke about Tamil Nadu temples. If you remember, last week, Prime Minister took the cue from Mr. Subramanian Swami's uh, petition and Prime Minister also said that Tamil Nadu Mandir loot rakka hai. It is being looted. So things are fanning out. Things are getting crucial. War of, not war of words, it's like, uh, you know, Hamas and Israel war type of uh, political war is taking place in Tamil Nadu. Sir. That is our scoop, sir. If you can you can render any amount of replies or uh, urgent uh, answers, but this has no answers because Anna Malay has taken the lead. BJP is fully backing. Piyush Goyal went there. P. L. Santosh tweeted. Though there are differences within BJP about Anna Malay's uh, attitude, still Anna Malay is overriding that. That I have to conclude with saying Anna Malai will be victorious against DMK's onslaught. Sir, if you enlarge it, DMK is adopting Mamta Banerjee's style. Arrest BJP workers, kill them, otherwise arrest RSS leaders, ensure that Ananda Prasad Reddy's arrest and others arrest are also indicative of MK Stalin is adopting Mamta Banerjee's style. Today, where is Mamta Banerjee? She is much closer to Narendra Modi than any other political leader today in the country. She has silenced in Mahua Maitra's case, even in other cases. Mamta Banerjee has ditched Rahul Gandhi and getting closer to Mr. Narendra Modi. I have post-2024, you wait and watch. Narendra Modi will ensure that Mamta Banerjee will abuse Rahul Gandhi. <laughs> sir, last one before we go, sir. 
uh, you said two more DMK leaders are under the scanner next week. Some small hint, buddy came and told you in your ear. Any the, 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 same, the same thing which I stand by last uh, week also we debated uh, previously that the name starts with D, ends with Y. That is what. I'm, sir, I'm drawing a blank, sir. Oh, 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 my God. I want to go. Oh, it starts with J. J as in jum, Jumbo. And Jumbo. And N as in Y. N oh, with okay. Y. Yeah. Hmm. So, these two are crucial for DMK. And World protector. Balaji, well, well, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And Gentle Balaji's, uh, uh, you know, uh, bail plea in Supreme Court is to be disposed of. We have to wait and watch how Supreme Court is going to take cognizance of that. So, this triangle. D N J N S I Central Balanch D N J N These three are going to create a sandwich for MK standard and DMK will be very, very difficult to come out of it like Mamta Balan. The first one, I I don't know. I hope yours you got what he was saying. D N and we've talked about this in the past. I'm not going to reveal it. I will leave all of you to let in by way of comments as to who Rajagopalanji is hinting at. <laughs> so Rajagopalanji, today I am going to let you go a little early, sir, because we have so many things to think about. Viewers, think about that, that flag hoisting thing. 100 flags a day. Okay. In even states like Telangana, they will start buzzing because DMK cannot be seen as allowing these things going. They made a huge mistake by taking down this this flag thing. Yeah, yeah, they will mistake. rip for it, sir. They will rip yes. for it, sir. They will rip for it, and anomaly with the backup of you know central government will ensure that DMK poll is also removed, BJP poll is also removed. Otherwise, ten thousand polls will come up in every part of uh, parts of Tamil Nadu, sir. And there is one little clarification. I got a lot of calls. Why last Sunday, Monday we missed it due to some domestic compulsions. My wife is unwell. That is why I have to attend to her. That is the reason I say my excuse me. But in future, I will ensure that Monday 10 a.m. is our time. She I hear Rajagopalan time. Because this capsule is liked by many, 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 many viewers. The way in which we rehearse prior to the recording of uh, the live shows and we give input as we did one in Tamil. It has crossed a viral stage. Similarly, this English one, that is the reason why I did a clarification from my side because I don't want to disappoint P Guru viewers. Sir. Thank you so much, sir. And viewers, as always, please show us your appreciation. Send us your comments, your suggestions. We're always watching. We're always listening. Namaskar. <laughs> Talk to you soon, sir. sir. Thank you.